Hey what is up everyone this is Ken here welcome back again to Tech Karan YouTube channel so finally Oxygen OS is here for the Redmi Note 10 Pro users if you are a user of Redmi Note 10 Pro or Pro Max based on Android version 11 the new OnePlus 8 Pro ported room is here by Tech Zone Unique and this one is one of the most awaited guest rooms out there for this device because a lot of devices already got this OnePlus OS but Redmi Note 10 Pro didn't got it yet but now we have the speed of course it's a portable room so you might face some bugs but one of the big thing one of the best thing what i liked about this one is the smoothness and performance the multitasking seems to be great and the smoothness is just good whatever you try to open in this build it's just opening very smoothly and it's going quite good this is just my preference this is just just my opinion if you use it then you will definitely find some ways but it's good it's actually good it was not expected honestly especially from my side but it's working quite good also as it is a portable room so as i previously mentioned you might face some little bit of bugs there but there are no major bugs so far for example if i want to try to call someone and if you want to check it out the calling and check if it is working fine or not it was working fine and yes uh, my sim sometimes support volty sometimes does not support volty but yes don't worry sim volty etc everything seems to be working fine no issues there too as this is a oneplus os and if you are a oneplus lover you will definitely love this because it has very cool features customizations etc does not includes extra or major customizations for example if you use me a tool device you have modded icon packs fonts and a lot more things this one does not this is stock oneplus 8 pro os for you where if you move on to the advanced section and if you check out the refresh rate unfortunately 120 hertz is of course but that is by default and you cannot change that you cannot move to 60 hertz so keep this in your mind of course it is a bug but it is not a major one as i previously mentioned you it's a portable room so yes you might face these bugs including that some other things are there for example face data it was working fine i tried that and it was working great and it was at once it not working but secondly it was working fine including that if you want other option you have the nearby charging station option in the battery section i'm not sure if it is working or not but yes i got that thing first time even my other devices where i tried one plus sports the things were not there so yes i'm not sure if it is working or not other things if you move to the camera section you get the open camera pre installed and open camera is a great choice if you want to record on your device video recording capture photos and a lot more things open camera is a choice for everyone and a lot of users always use open camera on their devices i didn't use it much but yes it's included already for you as it is included for you which means the default camera i think so that's not working i'll talk about that later on magisk this is pre installed unfortunately the drone is pre rooted so if you install this thing on your device first time the device will be rooted automatically you simply need to install magisk apk and you're good to go but this is unfortunate that safety net status is failing at least for me it's not working fine even i tried enabling the magisk hide option in settings if i move to the settings option and try to enable magisk hide it was enabled but unfortunately safety net status is still not passing for me there might be some modules where you can flash redo and safe net fix etc but this is the status of by default if you don't getting by default with the modules help you can do of course so that's not a major thing as i previously mentioned to you the camera the open camera is included which means the default camera is not working for you so yes it has some bugs for you unfortunately but it's a porty room and the major bugs include the camera but if open camera is there which is a alternative and it's working then it's no issues and even if the dialer calling etc seems to be working everything seems to be working so i think so you can give it try if you want to but it's up to you how to install this by the way this is not a major thing but still some users don't want to don't know about these things so make sure you have sd card because sometimes an internal storage has some issues select the file this is the file which you need and the link to download this file is already in the description and this is a one plus os so it might could be around 3 gb or maybe more than 3 gb so make sure you have enough data pack for that simply swipe to confirm flash these are just my steps i'm not sure about you and i would recommend you to format data for sure because that will just that will give you a good experience catch data metadata and delvic at catch you need to wipe these partitions after installing the zip file last but not the least format data and good to go this is all thanks for watching goodbye over the
edge Feel like I'm floating through the air